Hi everyone, welcome back to our Indian Sim Game Recap. Jim Rosenhouse along with you for game two of the series between the Giants and the Indians at Progressive Field in downtown Cleveland. Tribe coming in a half game back of the first place Minnesota Twins in the AL Central. And the teams were greeted by a tremendous night for baseball, late afternoon for baseball, early evening in downtown Cleveland. Look at the sky as the Tribe comes in at 20 and 14 on the season. And there's the Giants getting ready for action here as uh, they've had a tough start to their season, stuck on nine wins here in the early stages of May. And it doesn't get any easier for San Francisco as the Tribe rolls out Mike Clevenger. Start number seven, he's off to a good start on the season. The ERA under three, two and oh, the record. And he is the challenge tonight. Well, San Francisco got to Clevenger in the first inning, put a run up and it stayed that way until the bottom half of the third when Carlos Santana went deep. And it swung and hammered to deep right center field. It is gone. How about that catch by the fan in the front row in front of the Indians bullpen? So a 1-1 ball game heading to the seventh it stayed. That's when Mike Freeman came through with a big RBI triple to put the Tribe in front. And with the inning still going, Oscar Mercado did damage. The pitch swung out and belted. Deep left field, gone to the bleachers. And we get a second look at that home run from the always innovative first base cam. 5-1 to one Tribe at that point, and then in the eighth inning, Jordan Luplo added to the party for the Indians. Swung out and belted to deep left, away, way back, gone to the porch. And while the Indians were scoring runs, Mike Clevenger was piling up the strikeouts. See fires, and the pitch waved at, he's got another one. And in the end, with the Giants mounting a rally in the ninth inning, the Tribe turned to Brad Hand, the American League leader in saves, and he got the job done once again. So the Indians win it by that final score of 6-4. to four. Solid effort for the Tribe in this one. James Hoyt in relief did some good work as Mike Clevenger pitched well, but the Indians did not forge ahead until late in the ballgame, so this one was in the hands of the bullpen, and the Tribe has now won four straight after dropping five in a row since they snapped that losing skid down in St. Pete. Things going very well for this ball club as they take the first two games of this series with the Giants, and they do it in convincing fashion at Progressive Field on this late night or late afternoon, early evening, as uh, you see a 6-4 to four final with the Giants making it somewhat close there in the ninth inning. Taking a look at our star of the game, it's Oscar Mercado, two for four with a home run, a couple of runs driven in. Another big night for Mike Freeman, another two-hit game. Same for Carlos Santana, and a big RBI base hit for Francisco Lindor as well. Hoyt with the win. Solid relief, hitless innings, a pair for Hoyt, and Brad Hand with save number 15. So the Indians look for the sweep on Sunday afternoon against the Giants. Join us then for the Sim Game Recap.